Robert L. Kahn, 69, Columbia College. My dad took me to my first Columbia football game. It was Columbia Lehigh. I was four years old. My father emigrated to um, the United States in 1910. Graduated in 1920, won a Phi Beta Kappa Key. There was only one place that I wanted to go, and, and the only question was whether or not I was going to be able to get in. I loved um, studying economics here at Columbia. I loved my professors. There was an enormous amount of individual attention and interest given to how each student was progressing. I started working for the radio station as a freshman. I was actually announcing uh, on live radio a game from Madison Square Garden. And he puts up the second. It's good too. 56, 53. I never dreamt that, that that could happen. And if it were not for Columbia, I never would have been there. One horrible night, the police came onto the campus in full riot gear with sticks and raided all the buildings that the students were occupying and dragged them out forcefully. There was no press allowed in, onto the university campus. So the only means of reporting the news and what was happening here um, was our radio station, WKCR. I put together a scholarship fund in my father's name. and um, I have a radio, st the radio station, there's a Bob Kahn sports studio. And um, there were, uh, on my 20th anniversary, I endowed a president's chair. Having the, the opportunity to meet kids who aspired to go to Columbia um, was far more gratifying to me than writing a check. Even though by that time I was out in California, they said that if you do donated $10,000 to helping the football stadium get constructed, you could have season seats um, for 10 years. And so I did that and, and I still have those seats to, to this day. It's very humbling to be singled out and especially to receive a medal with Bill Campbell, who has been one of the great sons of Columbia forever and ever and ever. It was a very, very special day and one that I will never forget.